Hello, we're looking at a time lapse here of the creation of the Banith. Now, Baniths are fantasy slash mythical creatures that live on Mars. I really don't know too much about them, um, mainly just because I didn't really do any research or homework on these for the most part, other than to find some images on Google Images so I knew what exactly I was making a model of. This was requested for a server by old coder um, so this will be a mind test mod or portion for a mod the model of it anyways and the texture of course it'll also be available to download for free on my website where you will probably be watching this video uh, basically started off the modeling of it just with a cube it's what i usually use for my animate or for my modeling and then did a real simple bone system just doing an attack cycle here Trying to figure out a walk cycle with eight legs turned out to be a lot more confusing. So I actually gave up for the point in time right there and went on to the texturing, which is basically just a lot of doing changes in GIMP, exporting, and then reloading the texture in Blender and kind of looking at it in the 3D view. Usually I do use Krita to do my textures with my graphics tablet. But for some reason, it doesn't play very nice on my desktop, which is what I was doing the time lapse on here. And I wanted to keep everything with the same resolution pictures for the time lapse, so I just did it with GIMP, and it turned out okay. Um, yeah, I, I prefer Krita for doing this kind of pixel art. Even though GIMP really does work better for pixel art with their tools, I just like the filters and the the way that Krita works with a tablet. You get a lot better pressure response and everything, but I wasn't even using my tablet because it doesn't really work with my dual screen setup. Um, and basically for the walk cycle, I just decided to double up the legs and go with my standard four-legged walk cycle and just have both of the front and both of the rear legs moving in tandem. And then I added in some little animation for like head bobbing and the tail moving. So as it walks around, there's a little more motion than just the legs moving. Uh, and in just a second here, we're going to see some animations from the animal actually being rendered out. Just did those inside of Blender with Cycle Render Engine. So hopefully you guys enjoyed.